Hello, welcome. Time to try out some Ray Traced Doom. Starting with, uh, Sirius wants me to show off PR Boom. Um, version of the Doom re uh, Ray Traced. They also have a Do Doom 2, but, like, yes. this one doesn't work in co-op, unfortunately. Yeah. What is this, this one, one called? This one came out in 2022. It was uh -huh. made by a different person or a different team. No co-op support, unfortunately. So you use PR, PR Boom, boom doesn't have any co-op support in the first place, is the thing, yeah. Trash fucking... Well, they, some trash people said they got trash. it working, but it's super laggy. It doesn't work very well. It's not even intended for multiplayer, like, at all, so... From all what right. I read on the forums. Crap, so this looks so different. Look at the visuals here. Let's start playing the level. You should choose, like, episode three or maybe... Um, I guess to the first one. First one, please. Oh yeah, we have whole Schultz soundtrack added in, which is not normal. Yeah. Flashlight. Yeah. So here's the flashlight. This option is not added in the new one, which is due to ray trace. Oh, I feel like I'm moving it's slow, slow, slow motion. What the fuck? This one does feel weird, doesn't it? The Doom Two one feels normal. This one what has the this fuck? weird kind of laggier feel. It's slow. It's like your character's fucking starts rolling super slowly. Yeah. But the flashlight is very useful addition, and I don't know why the fuck was it's been requested. So moody the with the the lighting. See if yeah, it's, sometimes it gets so dark. Let's test the light, light the on this. Oh yeah, look at the flashing boom! The barrel, nice. And the barrel explosions in the second one look way better because they actually have light. The barrel actually emits the light to the source as it blows up. Like, it so slow, my character is in this. What the fuck is he walking? Maybe. Is this like not auto run on all default? Fucker, he's running for me. I would say though, this is a less, um, I don't know, just a lesser version of implementation of the RTX lighting than the Doom 2 one. It's like way more advanced, whatever, whatever uh, methods they're using. So, this looks kind of cool, but yeah, just show off the bit of this level, like run through this level, and then you'll see. I think the Doom 2 one looks. Significantly better. I feel like I'm running in slow motion. It's weird. Yeah, I was playing this earlier, and I was just like, it does feel kind of weird somehow. Wow, look at that lighting, though. I better use my flashlight. Look at that yeah, uh, yeah. the shadow on the med kit. That's super nice. That is very cool. Yeah. See, you're gonna miss this fucking flashlight when we're playing the actual Doom Two One in co-op. You're gonna wish you had this fucking flashlight. Well, look at my my character. Crazy, yeah, because there's oh. a light source behind you. Turn off this flashlight for the mood. The blue looks uh, pretty pretty decent here. Again, that's going to look way better in the new 2 one. Because it glows. Look, how, look at when he shoots. He glows. Yeah, a little light, little light sphere around him. Go to the end of the level. Alright, run. There. Very nice. I like how they're hiding up there in the dark. Uh, the poison does glow a little so bit. so weird how the bullets... Much. These motherfuckers think that when the bullet hits a wall, it illuminates it. <laughs> so yeah. I, mean, it I think they're all fire. What are those fire rounds? What are those called? Well, incendiary rounds? rounds? Yeah. Incendiary rounds. Bam, wow. Incendiary. Now, by the way, the corpses. What do you think of these corpses and shit? I like how they give the shadows off and they look 3D, yeah. yeah. Uh, you're gonna see the, the, the look at the shiny floor here. Look at this nice shiny yeah, floor. I do, I do like the shiny floor shit. Look at that, just the light on that texture is pretty nice. Yeah. Uh, like how yeah. the shadow, you know, shadow appears behind him as he shoots. Look at his fire. fireballs. Nice. Overall, pretty cool. Pretty nice uh, use of RTX technologies. And of course, it all depends on how they decide to light each room. They have to place the light sources. Since Doom 2 didn't actually really have actual light sources, they just had like sector light levels. But I think they're actually placing light sources to, to create the well, the light to fall off or whatever. You know? Doesn't it kind of look a little weird in some of these darker, shadowed areas? It's not kind of you know. You see what I mean? Like the shadows are a bit. Weird. 
shading on the shadowed areas of the walls a bit weird sometimes. A bit inconsistent. When you shine the flashlight at stuff, it turns it into like old school graphics, and when you turn it off, it becomes super shiny. It's weird. See that? Yeah. When you shine the tech, uh, it's just like old texture. Shiny bump map texture. Yeah. Still think the flashlight's very useful to have, though. But I do like how the little enemies cast shadows, your character casts shadows. The outdoor areas, though, what do you think of the outdoor areas? They're, they're kind of just normal. Let's looking, go out right? there. Yes, Look out there. That one area. Yeah, it's only the indoor areas that look moody as fuck. This looks moody. Yeah. Like, look at the lighting. Go back to where you just were. The other side? Well, yeah. Pull this. Yeah, that's cool. See, they put a light source here for this red light in the secret. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Look at the that. door light. Oh, yeah. Because it closes. That's cool. Oh, that's very good. Satisfying. Now go back around to be behind you. Go back over here. Look at no, no, uh, go even further behind you. Now look how weird the shadowing looks here. Doesn't it look weird? Like look at the textures there. It's kind of like something's what, weird, like what? bumpy or something. Like right there, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why. It just makes me think of like it's not like very smooth or something. It's kind of weird. It just ends up looking weird in some places. For some reason, they never decided to make Doom 2 with this version. They just kind of stopped with Doom 1. Yeah, the outdoor is just basically full bright, so it's yeah. barely noticeable here in any of the effects. Alright, um, look at like episode 3 for a second. Let's just see how it's like the first map in that is like different type of lighting, you know? It's more unnatural lighting. Inferno. Yeah, this is the first map, so it's like more like red light tones. But so they actually lit it kind of red. Light, which is like... Imp fireballs are nice. But overall, it still makes it a very different and interesting playthrough of Doom One. Instead of just playing it vanilla. The like music. We're currently playing it. This is this doesn't have a remix song. It's so quiet. Hear that? Oh, this one doesn't have a remix. I thought that what we did was we. I thought I did remix the whole thing. I did. I, I had to get to copy the files over for a lot of the song games, but I never did it on this PR boom version thing because because we gave up on this when it didn't have co-op. Right, we only did and rename the Doom Two ones or something, right? I did the Doom One ones, but only on the version we're actually playing, which is the Doom One plus Doom Two. Oh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, yeah. You must have only done the first episode on Doom 1, because this is... Yeah. The laziness. We ended up not, we ended up not using this, because we figured out it has no, it's no co-op, so... Yeah. It became worthless. That comes down to the Kex engine using just one file for each song, and then reusing it on the map where it's reused. Whereas in Doom 1, it actually... Uh, the files are copied multiple times wherever the maps need it. Oh, this, is, this is cool. Look at that blood. blood. Fuck. Fucking 13. Oh, fuck. 7 health. Jesus. She murdered here. What the This is why you need flashlight in this, because they didn't make sure to add light sources in every, every single place. Look at that water right there. That's dope. The blood, I mean. <laughs> Super shiny. Yeah, that's cool. the, the water looks probably even better in the Doom 2 Ray Trace. So let me pull my cool cat. We're about, we're about to actually play. I like how you saw your little Doom Marines, uh, like when you turn there, like you see your shadow Doom character with this little helmet, you can see the shadow yeah. of the helmet. You can identify that that's him. <laughs> I don't know why his helmet's turned sideways when you're looking forward, but yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Flashlight. Holy shit, entering a dark ah, hole. I like that. 
definitely makes it more like Doom 3 style, where it's like horror. Yes, look at this, it's fucking pitch black. Fucking freak over here around the corner with the shadow. He's in the shadow, you think Carmack, flashlight. You think Carmack wished he could have done this with Doom 1 and 2? Probably he wished he could have done this, but the technology just wasn't capable. Well, he was, you know, he, he wished it so hard that he made Quake, so... Yeah, you know. Yeah. <laughs> and then he made Doom 3 because he was still not satisfied. Yes, and then in Doom 3 he finally reached, I think, the point that he originally wanted to have, which is like the full, like the fans that would be spinning with that are casting lights and shit. Yeah. Because Quake One, I mean, the lights were still pre-baked. It wasn't like this where was it? Yeah, it was pre-baked lights. Yeah, pre-baked. Sure. Yeah. It wasn't until Doom 3 that they had the uh, yeah real-time lighting. Flashlight. Lighting. He's like, it took me over 10 years, you know, to finally reach that technology. And level. then he left its software and then he went to do awesome Oculus stuff. And then he's apparently he works on supercars or something like that, you know, now. <laughs> did you know that? <laughs> <You're> like, Jesus. <laughs> he's like, he did uh, Oculus optimizations to help those idiots out. But know, but then he left, left Facebook because tech. Facebook bought Oculus and he, he left because he said like he wrote like some article on Twitter like a one page post that was said like I've just never dealt with like as as a person who's spent his entire life dedicated to optimizing and doing things correctly I just can't work for a place where they do, they run their entire like company this inefficiently <laughs> is that fucked that's why he left yeah. in the end I Did, think he left at a, at a good time because he's this generation, so it's just, it's just gonna get worse and worse, man. Yep. I'm gonna go further and further away from the combat ones. Wow, look at that light when I shoot pistol. Look, look at the lighting in this area. Look how it's like this nice, like, darkly lit, gloomy. Look at so this, this map. Doesn't, wow, look look like how long this cockroach demon, demon this fireball lights up the whole fucking. He's a look fucking light beast. So light beast, beast evil. Fireballs. Look through that shit when he's like. Not shooting his fireballs. I like this, uh, the red sheet he has, yeah, for that shit. And then, oh, look, there's a shadow. I like the lighting. I like how they can change the whole color of the, of the map's tone or whatever. It's way more ominous. This is a whole shell one, right? It definitely sounds like it. We haven't actually reached this uh, episode yet because we're currently playing the. Doom Look at this Doom motherfucker! 2. Look how smooth he looks. What the fuck? Yeah. Whoa. It's a really good. Uh, it's a really good invisible look or whatever. What the hell is this mode? Berserk. We'll be like this for the rest of the episode. Berserk. Uh, you're like, uh, if you drink a lot of beer, you're ready to punch everything out. I don't know. I'm ready to fight you. Too bad they can't. They run into this little wood thing. <laughs> And oh, then he wakes fucker. up from his drunken stupor, and that was a car. He hit a car. You know? <laughs> he just did an accident. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos like that where the drunk person's like, "I didn't do anything," and they they pan the camera out with some fucking car wreck that they just got <laughs> about it. He didn't do anything. I don't remember that. Killed like oh, eight babies. Driving. Pregnant Isn't mother. That behind you? Yeah, I was gonna look at it. it. Cool. Look at that nice. Flashlight. Look at the fire. No flashlight. The fire behind you. Right, right in there. Oh, no, 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 where that corpse is. Yeah. Lava. Eh. Uh, that's okay, I suppose. It's not that difficult. Like I want that. Yeah, I don't even mm -hmm. remember how to get that secret. What's it to do with this? No, it has to do with. Going to the different fingers of the hand. Remember, this level looks like a hand. And then, holy oh, switches in those different fingers. Eventually, unlock everything. What's this fuck? I unlock the entire hand. Well, the entire hand. The entire hand. Entire team, though. No, eleven now. That's it. all got you. Okay, let's go on to doing two. Nicely done, sir. Please wait as I switch games. Yes. Now we'll now also... Launching Doom 2? 
co-op host two player. Co-op join. We got them batch files the ready. Batch boy. files ready, yeah. <laughs> like it's 1990, 1990, literally. 1990. <laughs> files. When did Dr. Boss come out? All right, so slight thing here. For some reason, when you load this in co-op with a server join or whatever, it starts off with no textures. It's like this weird white shit. Do you see this? And like cloudy mists, um, some kind of wonderland. Yes. But so you can fix it if you just do change map. Just change it to a different map. And then this looks correct. But we're gonna change it back. To map one. So at first we're like, oh man, it doesn't work, but then we realize it's just the textures don't load right away. This is how it looks, and if you're playing in single player, this works like this right away. His volume was down. Did you, I'll show the soundtrack. Did you want your series cam on? Yes, please. Series cam on. Yeah, so look, what do you think I'm BJ. BJ Blaskovitz over here. There's a mirror here for some reason. He's like the BJ Doom Marine. Yeah, here you can look at your character. Oh yeah, we're using still the 150 skins mod, and it works with the with yep. this. Uh, what is it? This is actually GZ Doom, but it's a modified version of GZ Doom or something. Yeah, they use a specific version that they modified, and then the dash file and then the WAD name does work with the dash file. Yeah. Why is it showing my butt? It's weird. I don't know, I haven't seen my... Oh yeah, I see my butt now, but when I turn away... When you away, push, when you I start walking side. forward, then you, when you're moving, you're, you show forward, but when you stop, you show your butt. So if you're sliding <laughs> still, it's like you're sliding forward. This I'm mirror. Scorpion. I'm a yellow scorpion. Very good. What does scorpion say? Get, Get over, over here. here. Yeah. There you go. Alright, um... Oh, that's so true. Let's just compare the quality of lighting compared to the other one we just saw. Oh, yeah, and this one has the enemies are, are like voxels now. This is using voxel enemies. Look at this fucking lighting, voxel like, motherfucker. Three more light sources have been added in the, in the past. <sighs> look at the way this guy looks, though. It's super 3D, but voxels don't look as good as pixels. They've always. They've, have you seen yeah. those games that are like. Like, not Minecraft, but like voxel games where they have these little tiny voxels. They always look so stupid and childish. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. The pixel art that looks like artistic and cool. Here's a very good, very good direct comparison. Your character is is a pixel. I mean, is a, is a sprite. And this is a this is a pixel guy over here. Voxel guy. But then they, in order, the reason they did it is because how would you be able to show a sprite on the ground like this? You know, and have it still yeah. have the lighting proper and everything? And it's well, weird so, blood. The one we were just playing, I think it looked fine. Corpses had little shadows. I think it looked pretty cool. Yeah. I'd so, be fine with that. I guess they just cho they chose to go with full 3D voxels characters. Yeah, they lose their original kind of character, to be honest. But yeah, they look okay when they're they moving. It's like this, this is a voxel imp. Which yeah, he is. He looks okay when he's moving. It looks kind of cool to actually see the like whoever made these voxels did like. A lot of it work, don't you think? I read that they did a one-to-one -one transposing of the... Well, but they did Right to... Oh, voxel. holy fuck, because they could look at the eight angles, and then they'd be like, yeah. edit, edit, edit. But they'd have to be, like, yeah. sculpting it and shit. That's probably took they them a lot. They sculpted it as good as they can do it. From every angle. Holy fuck. Yeah. Which is crazy, because the original game used a little 3D actual clay models. So then, like, yeah. that's why the sprites look so good. So it does, like, if the sprites didn't match perfectly, because they just drew the sprites, like in Wolfenstein, then 3D modeling them wouldn't have been as easy, right? Because now you're, like, dealing with, like, hey, at this angle, this doesn't match. And, like, but because the source was originally a 3D model, it matches perfectly. Your armor. <laughs> the armor glows, by the way, so you can always see it in the darkness. And so, uh, in this, there's no flashlight, so, like, if you go into a dark hole, like here, like, no flashlight, you know? You just have to make sure they add uh, light sources. I'm okay with that, because guess what, I was turning the flashlight off most of the time in the other one. Yeah. Because I like the way the darkness looks, and so... Flashlight the is a cop-out. Look at this blood, as you move by the blood, it kind of changes a bit, it's kind of weird. 
It changes? Oh, it's shiny. And like, as I'm, as I'm moving, the blood morphs around, doesn't it? No. Oh, it's uh, steady for you? Yeah. Look on my screen, it morphs around, it's weird. Oh, weird, it's like disappearing. Sure oh, that's weird, mine doesn't do that. Oh, yes, it does. It, it's it because do it's like, it's got a render range, so like when it's too far away, yeah. it starts to disappear. Eh. So you can turn it off, you can turn it off if you don't want it, but we're gonna leave it on, I think. It's fine. This one, the Ooh, lighting, uh, it doesn't have that weird old bumpy quality that the other one had, as far as the, the light, the wall textures and stuff. The shiny, the shiny floors, the shiny walls, yeah. Fireball, super nice. the lighting without the shiny. I like their glowing fireballs, though. That's pretty cool, right? Yep. There is a secret, but it's in pitch fucking black. But look what we did. Do you see that light source? That was added, because guess what? We have to fucking see it without a flashlight, so... <laughs> is that a med kit? Added. It's a med kit. A stim pack. I like it. Do you remember, do you remember how to open this shit? Yes. Then you just pulled the switch in here. Oh, fuck it. I opened the other one accidentally by running over it backwards. If you jump over this light or whatever, that opens the rocket launcher. Notice how their Let's go get the rocket launcher. Yeah. yeah. Notice Where's... how their fireballs don't like. Uh... Whoa. Oh, that's cool. That's a good. That's a very good extra light source. Wow, and it's like all super 3D and voxely. <laughs> Look at that fucking voxel rocket launcher. <laughs> nice. That badass looking? Yeah. I like it. You stand there in front of it and behind it. I mean, behind the light, so you're illuminated. Yeah, like a go come forward a little bit. Right there, perfect. Yeah, that's gonna be the screenshot right there. I'm in the God Ray night lights or whatever. <laughs> street light. The All right. Street light. So you're gonna say the fireballs or then? Fireballs are not as bright in this version. At, or like track it even fireballs lit up the entire fucking scene in the other one. Oh, look at that oh, red you, light. You have to pull that switch up there. Red light up there. Did you pull it? Yeah, the Kaka Demon thing would light up the whole level. This one, the imps lights up like a green. I don't know, Did you pull feet, it up there? Feet. I didn't see you go up. What the fuck happened? No, I, no, I jumped off. I didn't need it. Alright, and that opens this shit. I wanna rocket them. Yes. Whoa, yes. That wow. Cool wow. The rockets look really good. I'm gonna shoot one. Look I'll save it for the next gun. map, actually. Look at that. Look at that shotgun. It's they could have made it a little. Uh, I guess it's. I guess. They want to be realistic. It's so thin yeah. looking, but yeah. Blood, buds like voxels are, are smaller scale dots or pixels or whatever, so it's more. more they didn't make it like wider, pixels. like on the pump part, so. But this is doom, so they have to signify, hey, this is uh, five years before, four years before <laughs> blood, so it must be more low res. It must be more old school, you know. Look at that exit science shit. It's cool. Super glowing. Yeah. Frozen to a blood mist. And that's that it, shit. Uh... This will be a fun playthrough. Uh, I'm gonna shoot a rocket at these fucks. Stand there for the screw for the screenshot, sir. <laughs> As they get exploded behind you. <laughs> Very nice. Whoa, did that stay what the fuck that's like, the light stayed for a long time. That was weird. See that? It's, like, still illuminated. Yeah. It's like the flash <laughs> slowly dissipates. Like, what the fuck? Is that your eyes adjusting to the light? Whoa, look at this water. Yeah. This water is even nicer than the one in the first one. Um, should we do this map real quick or no? We should just do a separate map per video. Yeah. Se separate maps is fine. Look Very at this quick. fucking red light, though. Holy shit. The red water, yeah. So this is a significantly higher quality ray trace use than the first one, as you can tell. And it so. works with fucking GZ Doom, or it's not the original GZ Doom gets modified, but it's still GZ Doom, so it works with co-op yeah. inherently. It does work with mops, with mods, with mops. It works with mops, yo. <laughs> Mop that water. Which means, by the way, does this work with map packs? Like, uh... Um, like I thought that it doesn't, deep? because, uh... No, because we were yeah, trying to play this with Doom. Separately lit. We, we, we were trying separately to play this with Doom One, but we can't because it doesn't have the the wad. Yeah. They need to redo the whole map. 
pack, yes. the, the map files. All these light sources added on the walls here, these would have to be done for every single map individually, so... Yeah. That's unfortunate. I wish they would, uh, I wish you could have a solution. Like, if there's a bright pixel in the game, it automatically considered yeah. emitting the light. And then if they'd have light. Maybe AI, once it gets advanced enough, can do stuff like manually relight a level and do. Because they'd have, like, light looking through. textures in the game. You know what I mean? Like, they'd have light. Like, light. What kind, nice kind of nice the textures look, by the way? If you look, look at this way over here, like, the textures actually look somehow even more high quality than they originally were just because of the lighting that's used on them. It's pretty amazing. Nice. Yeah. Alright, next time I'll play this map. Tears Co-op. Now, 